welcome to Media Teach. Today is building your vocabulary test 1. Answer each question for 10 seconds only. When the bell rings, time is up. Then, we will discuss each answer and its meaning. Comment your score below at the end of this video. Good luck! Number 1. The following are examples of the word palindrome, except. Letter A a level. Letter B same. Letter C deified. Letter D noon. Letter E murdrum. What's your answer? The correct answer is. Letter B same. A palindrome is a word, phrase, number or sequence of words that reads the same backward as forward. For example, level, deified, noon, and murdrum. If you're unfamiliar with the word, the keyword here is except. So you find the one that is different from the other choices. Number 2. That perfume always evokes pleasant memories. Letter A angers. Letter B erases. Letter C calls up. Letter D confuses. What's your answer? The correct answer is. Letter C calls up. When you evoke, you make someone remember something or feel an emotion. The keys here are the word perfume and the phrase pleasant memories. The specific smell of the perfume makes you remember memories that makes you happy. Number 3. The attorney wanted to expedite the process because her client was becoming impatient. Letter A Accelerate Letter B Evaluate Letter C Reverse Letter D Justify What's your answer? The correct answer is Letter A Accelerate An expedite means you want to make something happen more quickly. The keys here are the word process and the phrase client was becoming impatient. When someone is impatient, you have to get faster to finish something. Number 4. The suspect gave a plausible explanation for his presence at the scene, so the police decided to look elsewhere for the perpetrator of the crime. Letter A unbelievable. Letter B credible. Letter C insufficient. Letter D apologetic. What's the answer? The correct answer is. Letter B credible. Plausible is something likely to be true, or able to be believed. A plausible person appears to be honest and telling the truth, even if they are not. The keys here are the word explanation and the phrase police decided to look elsewhere. This tells us that the police believes and gets convinced by the suspect that the suspect is telling the truth making his explanation credible. Number 5. He based his conclusion on what he inferred from the evidence, not on what he actually observed. Letter A predicted. Letter B imagined. Letter C surmised. Letter D implied. What's the answer? The correct answer is. Letter C surmised. Inferred comes from the root word infer. This means to form an opinion or guess that something is true because of the information that you have. The keys here are the words his conclusion and the phrase not on what he actually observed. The person guessed something, or surmised, without having much or any proof or evidence. The person did not predict the future, imagine an idea of something, or imply something is true without evidence. Number 6. There is no panacea that will solve our financial difficulty. Letter A cure all. Letter B answer. 
Letter C Paradox Letter D Criteria What's the answer? The correct answer is Letter A Cure All A panacea is something that will solve all problems and will cure all illnesses. The keys here is the word solve and the phrase financial difficulty. Number 7. A multifarious task would blank. Letter A have many different components. Letter B have very few components. Letter C. Be very complex. Letter D. Be impossible to complete. What's the answer? Letter A have many different components. Multifarious means having many different aspects or components. The keys here are the word task and the prefix multi meaning many. Number 8. Plaintive cries would be blank. Letter A musical, soothing. Letter B plain, uninteresting. Letter C loud, jarring. Letter D sorrowful, mournful. What's the answer? The correct answer is Letter D sorrowful, mournful. Plaintive is used to describe something that sounds slightly sad. Number 9. People with inveterate beliefs. Letter A can be easily manipulated. Letter B have adopted their beliefs from another. Letter C hold their beliefs deeply and passionately. Letter D change their beliefs frequently. What's the answer? The correct answer is Letter C hold their beliefs deeply and passionately. Inveterate beliefs are deep-rooted or firmly established. The word inveterate means something is done as a habit and not likely to change. Number 10. If you were involved in an altercation, you blank. Letter A had an accident. Letter B had a heated argument. Letter C served in a war. Letter D were part of a conspiracy. What's the answer? The correct answer is. Letter B had a heated argument. An altercation is a heated dispute or quarrel. It comes from the root word alter which means to change something usually slightly, or to cause the characteristics of something to change.